Kapla, my friends. It is time for another Star Trek mission crate from Loot Crate. Another one showed up. I don't know. If, from what I've heard, they are, again, I haven't really heard anything official, but from what I've heard, they're fulfilling their commitments and sending all the mission crates out, and then once they're done, they're done. So I don't know how many more of these I'm going to get, but another one came in the mail. So we're going to take a look at it today, as we tend to do, because, you know, reasons. All right, so open it up. This one's interesting because I actually got two of these. I got two of them on the exact same day, and took a quick peek inside and they're each exactly the same so um, I might be doing a giveaway later of some of this stuff um, because I, I will have doubles of it but I mean we'll have to see how that goes and uh, let me know in the comments what you think if you think that's a good idea to do a giveaway and what you think the giveaway should be or how it should be worked how it should operate what should I do to, to pick winners for different items um, let me know in the comments what you think and we can arrange something at a future time um, so I'm just going to set that right there quick and pull out the first thing and we have a Klingon baseball cap uh, on the back. It says Star Trek. Of course you get your cardboard in there. But uh, maybe I should wear this one for the rest of the rest of the video. A little bit of a thread there but yeah so a nice Klingon emblem hat. Uh, I should maybe send one of these to uh, my good buddy Bird of Prey 5, unless he already has one, uh, I don't know, but, so there we go, so that's the first thing. Next thing, as usual in these boxes, we've got a t-shirt, now this is a pretty cool t-shirt, this is the Red Alert t-shirt, Red Alert, this is what I can wear when I do my rants, so alert condition red, you know, neat. This, this I'll probably be keeping both shirts, just because, but um, we'll, we'll see. We'll see what you guys say, what you guys think, what you guys feel about that. Um, but again, the Red Alert shirt is very cool. Um, as is the new trend for these um, loot crates, um, we have a Eagle Moss ship. And this one is the... One of the many Borg vessels. We got this one. Now I forget what this one's called. It's not. It's not the cube. Obviously, it's not the sphere. It's the. It's the whatever this is. This shape, which is a neat design, really cool. Uh, I don't have this one in my regular Eagle Moss collection uh, to do a review on it, so I will be using this one, and I'll be keeping this one for myself. Um, there is, like I said, another one in the other box. It's exactly the same. So, but there you go, another Eagle Moss ship. And I think the Eagle Moss ships themselves make the cost of the of the mission crate worth it because they're about the same as far as cost goes. So, there's that. Next up, we have a. Now, when I first saw this in the box, I thought, "Good God." I hope that it has Defiant on the other side. It doesn't. It is so Star Trek. It's got the Borg cube in the background in green, and then the Borg claw or the Borg symbol um, on on it. So it's just a you know thermal mug with the little slidey thing right there. So nothing to write home about. Um, it's cool. I've got a bunch of these from, you know, various places. So like I have a cupboard full of this kind of shit. Um, but this one, um, I don't know if I'll keep. I might get rid of both of these actually. Um, but I'm really looking forward to hearing your thoughts on how a, a giveaway of sorts should go. So that's that uh, there. Now we also have one more thing, and that's this is just a. Um, uh, thing for Star Trek Online. What do we get? Owners of this flyer can redeem the key below to claim the Discovery Starting Experiences Pack in Star Trek Online, PC only. This bundle is, of goods contains the Age of Discovery Starter Pack, two different bridge officers, Elite Service Starter Pack, and an exclusive emote and more. So, 
there it is there. I'm not going to give you the code. Uh, I do have an extra one of these, like I said, so if you're interested and you haven't already got the Discovery Starter Pack, um, again, put in the comments what you guys think, how, I think I, how you think I should handle a giveaway or some kind of contest to see who can get this stuff. Um, I'm always eager to hear your thoughts, of course, so... Um, See, I don't know about this hat. I mean, it's cool and all, but I don't, I'm not really a hat person. And if it, if, I, if it is, it's not baseball caps. Um, so, what do you guys think? Better with a hat or better without? Everybody's going to say better without. I just got a haircut, too, yesterday. So, anyway, so Klingon hat. And, of course, lastly, we got the... QRC code, which you can scan to get information about everything that's in the loot crate. Again, I don't know if the QRC codes are the best thing. I I would never, I've never scanned one um, of these anyway. I've scanned QR codes before, obviously, but I don't know why they just don't put in a flyer saying what's in the box because the way they did them in the first few mission crates were absolutely fantastic. There was some really good, um, you know, like one looked like a pad and it had all the information on there. It was really neat. Uh, and I think they're losing something by not doing that. But that being said, I think they are scrambling to catch up and they are kind of um, trying to save some money and cut corners. So this is a good way to do it. Uh, so there you have it, guys. Uh, the inside of the box is it's the standard new Mission Crate box. There's the UFP symbol. It says Star Trek Mission Crate. And uh, just the standard box. So, so quick review of what we got. We got the Klingon cap, baseball cap. Do Klingons even play baseball? I mean, in Deep Space Nine they do. We will destroy them. But Star Trek on the back. We got the fantastic, very cool, red alert shirt. Red alert shirt, red alert shirt. Alert condition red, I think it's really cool. You'll see me wearing this on Trek Yards and Captain's Logs. So, yeah, very cool. I like, like the addition of that. We've also got the Borg Star Trek coffee thermal mug, um, which it's like every other thermal mug around. But, you know, that's that. And lastly, of course, the, I guess the jewel in their mission crate, as far as they're concerned, is the Eagle Moss uh, Borg ship. So, that's it. That is the, um, I've lost count which, how many mission crates this is now, but there it is. Um, so, I mean, we do have our code for, track, uh, for Loot Crate down below in the description. If you want to go and order any Loot Crate, it doesn't matter if it's Star Trek related or not, you can do so and use the code TREKYARDS on checkout to save yourself some money. However, I'm not sure if it's still valid. Uh, as I said, I tried contacting my rep and haven't heard back. So, um, click the link down below if you're interested. Scope it out. See if you can maybe get a Mission Crate. I don't know if they're doing new orders for them or if they're just fulfilling all the old orders. Um, but it's something that you might want to check into and try to save yourself some money and get them if you're interested. So it's down there in the description, as are a bunch of other links for saving money on Eagle Moss, uh, getting some Trek cards, merchandise, lots of cool stuff down there. So check out the links down below. And of course, if you can help us with PayPal or whatever, or join the channel, there's a join button. You can come to the rank of Captain, uh, Commander, Captain, or Admiral and get some cool stuff as well that way. So lots of ways to help us out. Lots of cool stuff in the description. Go check out the description links. There's always cool stuff down there in every video. So the description is worth looking at, guys. Um, so that is it for this mission loot, or Star, Star Trek mission crate, I apologize. Um, so by all means, let me know in the comments what you guys thought of the merchandise here, what you guys think of loot crate in general and the mission crate situation. Have you got your mission crates? Have you heard anything about the mission crate? Um, again, let me know your thoughts and comments. And like I said, I got two of each of these things. So if anybody is interested in a giveaway of sorts, maybe a live giveaway, some kind of funky promotional thing we can do. I don't want to do a quiz show or anything because, you know, everybody has Google. It'll just look stuff up. Um, so, 
if you guys have an idea for doing a giveaway and you're interested or you're interested in a particular piece by all means put it in the comments down below I'll consider your recommendations and I'll come up with something to actually you know get you guys included and send out some cool stuff I've done it before I've sent out Eagle Moss ships before um, so something to consider I might when I review this one I might give away the the other one uh, on that review so by all means make sure you're subscribed to both channels Trek Yards and the Captain Foley personal channel to keep an eye out for the Eagle Moss reviews and other things so you can learn when I'll be giving these away and how you can get one um, so I guess that is it until next time guys thank you so much for watching by all means uh, subscribe to both channels the captains my the captains Captain Foley personal channel uh, as well as the Trek Yards channel and don't forget to check out other videos by us as well. So until next time guys live long and prosper.